Well, despite the loss, Bills fans hopefully enjoyed at least part of this unique experience. Jeff Rusak went to the transit drive-in tonight where some fans had the best seat in the house. Wings, burgers, football. It's almost like the parking lot outside Bills Stadium on game day. Almost. This is a tailgate party, but it's at the transit drive-in. We are battling against Tennessee and we're battling against breast cancer. For $70 a car, you can drive in, park, tailgate and watch the game while staying in your designated space. All proceeds go to fighting breast cancer. The drive-in raised $7,000 on Tuesday. And it's fair to say that Bill's Mafia has really, 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 yeah, three reallys, missed tailgating. What does tailgating mean to Bill's Mafia? Everything. <laughs> Everything. Everything. Have some food, drink some beer. A lot better than, you know, being at home. A lot more fun. Well, yeah. unfortunately, we can't be at the stadium right now. Right. So this is the next best thing. I'll be honest, home opener, I drove around the stadium for about an hour looking for a tailgate, but uh, there's nothing going on. So here I am. The game did not go the way these fans were hoping. But even on the night of an odd Tuesday NFL matchup, things felt a little more normal. Transit Drive-In will host tailgaters again next Monday when the Bills play the Chiefs. Jeffrey Sachs, 7 Eyewitness News.